Good day ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Dom's Desk. In this kind of series, uh, I'm going to be going on Amazon or any other websites like Newegg, and I'm going to be searching up some PCs or some sort of tech, and we're going to be probably making fun of it, if not something else. We're going to be um, taking a look at some PCs that shouldn't exist simply. And uh, uh, before I play the intro, GT710, you see what I'm saying. <laughs> So the reason I got this idea is a friend of mine, he he said he got a new, so I, I was talking to him and I'm like, okay, you're going to get on your laptop. And he said, laptop, I got a new PC, I got a desktop now. I'm like, oh, well, the specs, you know, because I'm, I'm always interested in stupid, you know, specs guy, guy, you know, you got a new PC, something like that. You know, always, always kind of, you know, I seem interested about that, because he's getting 180 frames of Fortnite. And I'm like, oh, I mean, that's a respectable frame rate. And he says he goes into, and he goes into his task manager and he says, uh, GC710. And I'm thinking... This guy got scammed. Luckily, his cousin gave it to him, so his cousin got scammed rather than my friend. But now I'm thinking, I'm like, this is more. I I, I knew it was out there, but this is worse than I thought it was because my friend, but my my close, like I have a local friend who got this off of a website. So I, I need to check this out. So here we are on Amazon today, and we're gonna be seeing if we could just search up gaming PC and find in a in some sort of disastrous PC like a GT710 or something like that. So scrolling down, we have some budget PCs, and I mean, you know, GTX 660 and 50, first one, of course. Already we have a GTX 650, which isn't so ideal nowadays, especially for $550. Yeah, this is, it doesn't even tell you, I want to see this. It doesn't look like a bad system, it's, oh, we got the, the stock Intel cooler, like, there's all, it just made it fancy and just had, so just so people will buy it. 8 gigs DDR3 doesn't it still doesn't tell you the uh, i5 but it has a HDD a hard drive too uh, this is a scam this is a scam we're already like we weren't even a page in and we already have a scam this is so overpriced for what you're getting come on come on guys a thousand for a 2060 it's that was released 29 you know I'm gonna, I'm gonna leave that alone that's a pavilion that's respectable I know that brand 3050 for 700 dollars that's fantastic oh on deal okay yeah cyber monday deals you know all this this rog strix isn't on a deal rog rog i don't really care guys yeah but that's not even on a deal and that's 900 that's, that's, that's a thousand bucks and has 3060 so that's i mean i guess that's a hard drive oh god oh no come on dude what i mean try a little oh my try a little harder I mean, look at this. I've owned one of these keyboards, and it was shit. I guess it's, it's kind of cool, because it it, it, the specs aren't terrible, but, like, this is not not the... Scrolling down, uh, this this shouldn't be here. <laughs> That's a nice-looking system. Oh, yes. Oh, my gosh, there's another one. RX 550. I haven't seen RX 550 in a while. Oh, and they got one of these cool things over here. Look at all look, gamery with all the RGB and the tech. Oh, my gosh, look at them. S the PCI boards and stuff. This PC you don't buy for anything else but this cool thing right here. <laughs> Scrolling down, it, it's every, it's like every other other one. You see one of these. It's cr and this is Amazon. It's not like eBay or something. This is crazy. RX 5 Like again, this. Oh wow, that's actually, this is actually a really good price. But you get it. RX 580. That's 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 pretty mid range. I'll renew. That's by why. Quad i7. Ah, uh, I'm a bit concerned what quad i7 that is um i think this is the same person but before it looks very similar that's what they do oh the gtx 750 awesome card not fantastic for this price at all I, I, it looks like the same guy again i i don't think so i maybe i don't remember the name dude it was wait go back go back in time i mean you have many colors which is always fantastic but like no Mini PCs. Mini PCs are usually very expensive. 4K UHD. You you already know something's probably gonna be up if it has 4K UHD on uh, in the title. Okay, going down a little more. Oh wow, we just turned the page, and there's a Shin Shinobi. Sh Shinobi? Oh no, but I'm checking it. I actually want. I really want to check this out. Four times 3.8 gigahertz. Wait. 
Athlon X4 950 4X 3. Oh, you already know we got them. We got them Google PNGs on here. So for some reason I decided to hop into Google and try to make one of these listing pictures. So I found a Wi-Fi image, I downloaded that boy, hop into my editor, I picky, and then I started putting stuff into other things and came up with this, which I think is pretty respectable, given that I have no experience with Amazon, but I guess I do now. What card is this? RX550 again. This is fishy. You might not get your, your computer. Pure gaming power. You're not getting this PC if you order it. That's so far the most suspicious one I've seen. Another 4K dual HDMI output. Oh, this looks like our guy again. Not, you're not a very nice person, Larko, trying to scam people with three. Another 650. He made two listings. This man is going crazy. I can't see the inside this time, though. Oh, here we go. Another one of these. I guess this is a more modern um, Excel performance computer. <laughs> It's just, I don't know if it's just me, but I personally don't associate purple smoke with gaming on a sleeper XL machine, so Dell Tower. These are just funny. Let's keep looking a little more. This is actually kind of fun. Oh my gosh, 250? I want to search actually like under 100 and see what we find. Alright, let's see. Minimum, zero, because yeah. And max is, let's say, 150. Let's do 150. And go, let's see what we find. Uh, that's not, that's not even close. Ah, oh, here we go, 144. Just like the frame rate we want to get. This is just business. I mean, nothing suspicious about this. This is, this seems fine. It's just not gaming. I don't know why they'd ever put this in here. This is nowhere near you'd want to be for gaming. In fact, you want to run right the other way if you ever see someone offer you that for gaming. It, you're better off going into someone's van for candy than going over to someone and playing games on that, actually. Kimaru? K Kim... Kimaru? I'm gonna check this out. Celeron J3455. Up to 2.3 gigahertz. Oh, the powerhouse. It just says 6 gig DDR3. This whole title is really messed up. I mean, it's $100? Like... I don't really know what they're going for, because they don't have a graphics card, but they have all this gamer-looking stuff going on. Oh, you really didn't need to put GPU there. That's not- I wouldn't even count that as a GPU, man. And trust me when I say that, because I used to play on uh, an Intel integrated graphic chip that was worse than that for a while. I know. I think it was just about that. I played the uh, HD 530. Oh my gosh. You know, this gives me an idea. I kind of want to buy one of these old Optiplex or like Think Center systems and like beef it up or something. Make it like, do something fun like that. That'd be pretty funny for a video. I want to look and see if I find an actual gaming system though. So here we go. We found something. Hold on real quick. $169. Uh, GT730. That is not a GT730. That's why it has one star. What's the, wait? What, what is the what is the rating? Avoid vendors who do not disclose all the details about the product. They do not indicate what generation the CPU is. That's the only problem. Look, don't buy the don't buy the system because like, I I don't I, I that's not a GT 730. Look, they're different pictures. They're different pictures. Oh my gosh, that's that's a different PC. They can't do that. That's a GT 730. I don't even know. That's crazy. Ladies and gentlemen, if you want to get like a cheap system, I'm thinking you buy like an old office system. Like, let me, let me give you an example. Something like this. I mean, it doesn't need to come with peripherals or anything. Just, just something like this. I mean, this looks perfect. Make sure it's a, a larger one. I mean, it looks it looks larger. Uh, I'm not sure. I guess on the thinner side, but it should do. Uh, then we put like a GTX 1650 or 1660. Probably 1650. That's a good mid-range card. Uh, and then you really should be good. I mean, it's not going to have so much room for upgradability. Um, I mean, I'm trying to follow. I'm not. Yeah, this has DDR4, so this, you should be good for a lot of gaming with this, uh, especially with this SSD. Uh, this is a pretty. Yeah, and you'll have a system for like 250 bucks. But like before, we saw that GTX 650, and it was everything. It, like, what only thing you're getting with that is the RGBs and stuff. Like, if you want RGB, you can put something on this or on your desk or whatever. 
that it's just showing you how how these people are only out there to scam you for your money so on that note i think we learned our lesson for today uh, don't be buying gtx 650s uh i'm sorry for being out for a while i've been sick uh aside from that though i'll see you in the next one goodbye